If an air conditioner is not cooling properly, the fan is not working, or the coils are freezing, one of the unit's thermistors may be out of factory specification. To help determine this, you can use a multimeter to test the thermistor for electrical continuity and for changes in ohms of resistance. To conduct the test, you will need to disassemble the air conditioner in order to isolate or remove the thermistor. Depending on the air conditioner model, there may be more than one thermistor in the unit. The component may be located on the front of the evaporator coils or attached to a condenser coil refrigerant tube. The thermistor's wire connector may be located in a surface box or attached directly to the control board. Be sure to unplug the air conditioner's power cord before beginning any disassembly to reach the thermistor and its wire connector. Once the thermistor has been isolated or removed, inspect the component for a designated ohm rating. Then rotate the multimeter's range selection dial to the corresponding setting for ohms of resistance. If the thermistor's ohm rating is unavailable, start at the lowest setting for ohms of resistance, then rotate the dial to higher settings as needed to get a reading. Now contact the black meter lead to the thermistor wire or connector terminal you're testing and the red lead to the corresponding wire or terminal. At room temperature, the meter display should indicate close to the ohms of resistance identified on the thermistor or on the air conditioner's tech sheet. If the meter display shows no ohms of resistance, you'll know the component has failed and a new one will need to be installed. You should also confirm that the ohms of resistance can change as the temperature changes. Use a hair dryer to heat up the thermistor and observe whether the ohms of resistance increase or decrease. If the resistance changes, the thermistor should be functional. However, if there is no change in resistance, the thermistor is likely defective and should be replaced.